new technology may allow you to write on a computer screen using your eyes, not your fingers. How about that? We've got Lee Holtz of our science desk, who's written about science forever and a day, joining us now from Santa Monica. Lee, um, maybe, maybe I exaggerated just a tiny bit there, but you have written about science for a long time, so this has got to be particularly exciting for you, right? Well, it's a fascinating innovation because it arises out of a very basic and kind of fundamental question that uh, people were investigating. What's happened here is that a, a French scientist who was studying optical illusions uh, discovered a way that people can write with their eyes in cursive script on a computer monitor. And the researcher uh, Jean-Laurent Renceau in Paris um, told me that the smooth eye movements that produced by his system you know, they can be used to draw, to write, and even generate a signature. So, you know, Simon, one of these days, you and I may be writing our checks with our eyeballs. But more importantly and more seriously, the new eye writing innovation uh, could help severely disabled people communicate more freely, people who can't use their arms or their hands. And it could also even lead to uh, uh, visual control systems for pilots or drivers or surgeons. Hmm. And it's fascinating because it all comes uh, from using this optical illusion that this uh, fellow was studying to kind of control um, the very fine um, eye movements that normally make it impossible for you to kind of do this sort of thing with your eyes. Uh, it's really very interesting. Oh, and I just it turns was... out to be quite easy uh, for most people. So I was just you looking at some... that in two or three 30-minute training sessions, uh, the average person can you know, learn how to write their name or write numbers uh, with their eyes on this computer screen, um, you know, at a rate of about 20 to 30 characters a minute, which is pretty good. Well, I was just looking at some, some of the handwriting um, uh, that we have some p pictures of, and it looks better than my handwriting I do with my hands. So I was, it was very Im impressive there. Um, so 20 to 30 characters a minute um, after three to five 30-minute training sessions. That, I mean, that seems very impressive there. How soon will this get rolled out to the general public? Well, now, that's a very good question. Uh, these sorts of things are initially, you know, conceived uh, to serve the very, very special group of people, like uh, people with Lou Gehrig's disease, for instance, who are just simply uh, what they call locked in. I mean, they have no alternative means of communicating with the outside world, with their loved ones. Mm. Uh, typically, uh, you know, we read about these people writing books by blinking their eyes, you know, one character at a time. There are commercial systems out there that allow people who can't communicate uh, uh, by other means to use their eyes to uh, pick out special characters mm. on a screen or to uh, control a cursor to point at uh, something on a screen. What's very interesting about this particular uh, uh, system is that it kind of allows a, a real freedom of expression. I mean, once you learn how to do this, you're not limited by the characteristics of a particular uh, set of symbols or something, you can just, uh, you know, write freely with your eyes. Now, it's not uh, very complicated, and I okay. don't know how long it will take to bring it to market. I can tell you that in the short run, um, the researchers in France are mostly interested in applications for these, uh, for these clinical populations. 